Hello world and grace to you. We are at the mall today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I forgot the last time I came to a mall it was like this. It was COVID. <laughs> but we had to have a mask. So I'm loving this. Um, All the stores are empty too. Exactly. So she had to return something and now that she's done that I heard at Spencer's they have a cookbook um, for the anime One Piece, uh, specifically associated with Sanji. Um, I'm an anime YouTuber today, as you guys can tell, Dragon Ball Z. So, <laughs> so yeah, I wanted to get that cookbook and I want to try some of those recipes and figure we'll bring you guys along for the ride today as we walk around and see what's here. It really is empty today. Got a few people in front of us. Maybe once we get to the more central part of the mall, we'll start seeing people. So there is some people here, guys. It's crazy. <laughs> so yeah, I figure if we came more into the mall, there'd be more people in. There is, but still, I mean, for this mall, I've never seen this mall so empty. I mean, I don't know if it's early or if it's late, it was just an off day. Can we come here always on this day at this time? Yes, yes. I, yes. I love the mall like this. This is, look at this, guys. This is, this is awesome. This is the way all malls should be. I really think this is the way it should be. I mean, it's just, I'm free to walk as fast or slow as I want. I'm going to stores, look around, purchase stuff. I think that's cool. Huh? Lotion? <laughs> No, I'm kind of in a rush taking my wife shopping. So. You get time, Chris. I will. I'm not going back to see him. Just saying that. <laughs> Wanna say anything to the camera? That's horrible. I'm going to spill him. Ah, yeah. I guess so. Uh, we gotta find a different way back, even though there's only one way back. But we'll figure that out when that time comes. Just wanted to show the one piece hoodie. And this is at. FYE guys One of my uh, favorite stories to go in but without my kids. I feel sort of bad Who's her it's Wednesday. Oh If you guys are fans of Wednesday That's not a scary Chucky doll at all <laughs> That's super cute Could see if they have the one piece book here. Maybe I Started watching one piece again uh, recently because I, I was never really a One Piece guy. I watched the first 50 or 60 episodes years ago and it was very cool. But whatever reason I just stopped watching. And now because of the live action Netflix adaptation uh, I ran through those eight episodes and I thought it was pretty good. So I'm in about like 25 or 30 episodes right now. I, I see the differences and sort of the things that they left out. But I still think the live action was pretty good. And it kind of got me hyped up for the anime, so. And with that, I have seen some videos on YouTube of a cookbook. And so I'm curious and picking that up for myself. So we're gonna find that today, hopefully. All right, so I'm braving this alone. Sandy went in the Forever 21 somewhere behind me. And I'm on my way in this direction. Coming up on this side is going to be the Spencer's where supposedly they sell this cookbook because I looked down it. I looked for it online, and apparently Spencer's is supposed to be carrying it. I was going to order it on Amazon, but on Amazon it's thirty bucks, and at Spencer's apparently it's twenty, and I could have it now. So it's ten dollars cheaper, and it could literally be in my hands now. So I'm going to go find out for myself right now. Let's hope for good results. We're almost there. Wah wah wah. They don't have it. And almost every Spencer's didn't have it. There is one supposedly that has two copies. Um, but they did have something else here. I'm gonna see how far this one is. And if this one is not terribly too far, maybe I'll go and pick it up. If not, they had another sort of anime cookbook that seemed kind of cool. Supposedly it's based from all animes, which might be more intriguing than the One Piece one. Because I am not just a fan of One Piece, I'm a fan, obviously, of Dragon Ball Z and Super and Naruto and Chippuden. So it'd be pretty cool to try some of the recipes from them as well. But 
I just don't know how many recipes it's going to be drawn from those animes versus animes that I don't know at all because as much as I want to say that I'm an anime fan, I'm just not that deep into it. So I'm going to go find the missus. She's going to see how far this is and then I'll make a decision. All right, so I'm not alone anymore. She got some things from there behind us. And um, yeah, so the that place that has the Sanji One Piece cookbook is about 30 minutes from here. By the time I put gas in my car and everything, I mean, I deal with that half an hour driving going, half an hour driving, but it's just not worth the hassle. I'd rather order it online, but I am very impatient. I'm just gonna buy that anime cookbook. You know, I, I when I was going through it earlier, I also noticed that it said, uh, Demon Slayer, which I forgot to mention is also another anime that I do like and I'm currently up to date on. I'm gonna go purchase that right now. Alright guys, we just got the purchase. This is what our book looks like. Here's the back of it. As you go here, we're just gonna open up to a random page. And so we can see here, um, I think that's the name of the anime? I don't even know, but it looks good. Oh look. Rato, Misu Chasu Ramen, and that ramen looks pretty good. So we're gonna give this a shot. We're gonna make some uh, videos with this in the future. Uh, we're gonna go through some recipes, maybe try to do once a week or once a month even, because I have to figure out the ingredients and make sure I buy them all ahead of time. You're gonna have to Can't, find the, like a Chinese market. <laughs> probably, but I'll find a way to get the ingredients one way or the other. So, and there was a guy inside who was saying like, don't worry about messing it up because you know, there might be some complicated recipes. He's basically saying like, if you mess up anything, you didn't mess it up, you just made a new dish. So, <laughs> so we're gonna take that advice. Uh, if we make it correctly and we follow the recipe as it was intended to be followed, well then we made it correctly. And if not, then I did my own twist as I was inspired to make a new dish <laughs> using the cookbook, so. Uh, we'll see how things go with that. I guess with that, I'm gonna get on my way now. I'm gonna say uh, God bless, and we'll see you guys in the next one. But until then, may grace be with you.